Wireless technology is all around us, and it has changed the way we live our lives at home, at the office, and at school. It's certainly convenient, but is it safe? All wireless devices emit radio frequency microwave radiation, or wireless radiation, which can be harmful. Children are especially vulnerable because of their rapidly developing bodies, their thinner skulls, and immature nervous systems. Because wireless radiation can be harmful, every phone, every router, every tablet, virtually every wireless device, comes with a warning to keep a safe distance between the user and the wireless device. Studies show that exposure to wireless radiation can cause acute symptoms, such as headaches, dizziness and nausea, as well as more serious long-term effects, including cancer, changes in DNA, weakening of the immune system, and abnormal brain development. This should be a flashing red warning light for every parent of a school-age child, many of whom sit for hours every day in a classroom filled with wireless technology. So, if we know about the potential harm, why are schools installing more and more wireless technology? The government isn't helping. The U.S. Food and Drug Administration, which is supposed to set standards for controlling radiation emissions from wireless devices, doesn't actually have any standards for exposure. And the Federal Communications Commission, which regulates wireless infrastructure, has exposure guidelines developed almost 25 years ago by a group of engineers, not health professionals. The guidelines are based only on whether the exposure produces heating of tissue, not whether it causes other types of biological harm. And they're based on the bodies of adults, not children. Although these agencies insist that wireless radiation is perfectly safe, many scientists and medical professionals disagree. The large and growing body of peer-reviewed science shows that government standards are inadequate to protect our children. So, what can we do about this? The good news is, there's a solution. Hardwired connections eliminate wireless radiation in classrooms. These connections are faster, more reliable, less prone to hacking, cost-effective, and once installed, they're ready for whatever technology changes the future brings. Hardwiring a school doesn't interfere with any technology-based learning, and best of all, it's completely safe for everyone. Every parent wants the best for their child, and the best environment is a safe environment. Let's protect our kids. Let's hardwire our schools. To learn more, including things your school can do right now to reduce wireless radiation in classrooms, please visit techsafeschools.org.